माई डैड एंड माई मॉम दे लिव इन उत्तराखंड इन नॉर्दर्न पार्ट ऑफ इंडिया माई डैड एंड माई मॉम गॉट मैरिड वैन ही वॉज आई थिंक एटीन ईयर ओल्ड एंड माई मॉम वॉज फिफ्टीन ईयर ओल्ड सो आई केम फ्राम दैट बैकग्राउंड वेर इज लाइक मैन आर रूलिंग द फैमिलीज सो मैन इज इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड वुमेन आर लाइक लेस इम्पॉर्टेंट बट माई डैड इवन दो ही हैज सिक्स डॉटर ही नेवर नेवर लेट एस डाउन ही सैड डू वट एवर यू वॉन्ट टू डू इन योर लाइफ ओके आई वॉन्ट स्टॉप यू आई थिंक माई मॉम इंस्पायर माई डैड बिकॉज माई मॉम इज अ वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग वुमेन she always you know tell to my dad that i want to educate my daughter please don't stop them and my dad said okay my mom was really really sick we take her to to different uh, temples like sikh temples and muslim temples and like hindu temples and we couldn't get uh, any answer and any relief for my mom so one day my sister anjali met her friend her name is manisha so she said so we go to this church why don't you take your mom uh, here maybe the pastor can heal your mom so i said okay let me go first so when i went to that church first time it was in easter time and the pastor was you know telling about jesus christ i cried that day when they were worshiping him i did not hear anything what they were singing what they were talking i just heard one voice that he died for your sin and that really i was shocked i was like how can he die for my sin after one year i was coming from uh, from my college i had a exam and as i was walking i saw manisha so she was standing on the road and i was like what are you doing here so then she told me that you know i'm waiting for the elders then i was like elder what do you mean what elder means so she said i also don't know <laughs> but i but i'm waiting for the the two people who are who are wearing badge and they're wearing white shirt and black pant and they're coming to my home so i said to manisha that i'm going home and she said that are you coming to my home so i said no i'm not coming i'm going to my home cuz i have to prepare for my exam as i start walking i heard a voice hi sisters so i looked i looked back so they invited me they said no sister we are going to manisha's house would you like to come so i said no i'm already tired and tomorrow is also big exam for me i want to go home and prepare for that as i was sitting down i heard a voice that you should go i was so shocked like what voice i'm hearing and i was ignoring that voice till 15 minutes after like 15 minutes i was like okay i think i should go i told my my younger sister her name is ashu i said ashu let's go we are going to manisha's house so like she said why and i said let's go come with me so i went to their house i knocked the door and and i went inside so elder said i know that you will come they started you not know, teaching about joseph smith vision he was also uh, searching the truth joseph smith sees heavenly father and jesus christ my body was so calm my mind my heart was so calm i feel like this is the right place like this is it i never never heard about heavenly father before i know that jesus christ is there but i don't know that we have father also heavenly father so after they finish the teaching and and they give me their card they said sister this is our church and this is our number and and our church start in the in afternoon around 2 o'clock so would you like to come so i said elder i i'm already going to a church so they said okay but try to come to our church so next sunday i went to the pentecostal church and then in the afternoon i went to the church of jesus christ of latter day saints so in the evening i was you know sitting in my roof i look up in the sky i said whoever you are tell me what is the truth i'm struggling here i don't know what to do like you know somebody saying do this and somebody saying do that where i need to go i said whoever you are if you are real god tell me what i need to do i slept and i saw a dream in my dream i saw that the elders are giving me baptism 
I went to the water and came out. I don't know how to say it, but it's just literally feel to me, it's real. At that time, I know this is my answer. I call elder in the morning. I said, elder, I'm ready for the baptism. So after we all get baptized on December, my mom died. My hope and everything was, I feel like, like everything is gone. Because we are so close to our mom. Even though I joined this church, I have a hope that my mom will be healed and she'll be like before she was. And I have really much hope that, you know, that Heavenly Father will save her. But like she died. They talk about in you know, a plan of salvation. I know that I can meet my mom again. That is the way Heavenly Father was preparing me for that. He was preparing me to find truth. I think you know, this is all planned because I have the, the testimony. He, he was preparing me for that day and I can feel that I can meet my mom again. If you're searching for the truth for your own life, so ask God as I ask, as Joseph Smith asked, you will get your answer by Holy Ghost. I felt it in my heart. I listened to that voice. And I, I feel so happy to be a member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. And I want that everyone feel the same, the way I do.